Hey what's up everyone this is Frankie with Meekspace.com Today I'm going to take a few moments I'm going to show the friends how to uh, create an account at Meekspace.com how to become a Box.net collaborator and actually what that means and then how to download theocratic files for your devices now we're not going to focus on how to actually get the files on your devices there's going to be different tutorials on how to do that depending on what device you have but we're mainly going to just focus on what it means to be a box.net collaborator and uh, how to create an account on Meekspace and how to get that process all going so we'll just start off by kind of explaining what's going on so several years ago uh, many of the friends uh, came together and we created a website called Meekspace.com our goal at Meekspace was primarily to show the friends how to get files in the iSilo format which is just a, a proprietary ebook reader how to get iSilo theocratic files onto their devices any kind of you know electronic device that iSilo would run on so many years ago brothers started converting the theocratic literature into iSilo formatted files Today we have, you know, the full version of Watchtower Library 2010. We have, you know, the Watchtower and Awake magazines, the Kingdom Ministries, the Bible, uh, all kinds of uh, weekly study documents and everything, all in iSilo format. So our goal with Meekspace was to help you get these files on your devices so that you could use them for personal study, preparing for the meetings, and for field ministry and since then we've kind of moved we've tried various different ways of getting everyone the files keeping the files updated and whatnot we finally settled on in the last six months or so we settled on a new system where we use a collaborator type system what that means is we we have an account at a website called box.net it's just a public website where you can have an account and you can store your files there and you can invite people to be a collaborator in other words they can share they can see your folder that you have shared and so that's what we've done we have meek space has created a box.net account we've created a theocratic folder and we've shared this folder now this folder there's several people around the world that are Jehovah's Witnesses that have access to this theocratic folder where they can update the files so some people are assigned to update the Watchtower and Awake magazine some people are assigned to update the Kingdom Ministry others are assigned to update the weekly study material Just various people from around the world have uh, different assignments to keep these files updated and what we do is we share that theocratic folder in a read-only aspect to thousands of friends all around the world that wish to be collaborators or be partners with you know us in this endeavor and so that they can see the full files and so uh, you have to become a collaborator in order to see the theocratic folder that we've shared so basically the first steps is to become a meek space user so you have to create a meek space account at meekspace.com and once you've created an account then you can become a collaborator to the box.net shared theocratic folder which is where you're going to get all of your theocratic files now um, you can't just go to box.net and create an account because you're you need to be invited if you want to be able to see the theocratic folder and so you start by going to www.meekspace.com that's the website you see on my screen right now and you're going to see exactly what you see here uh, if you're not logged in. You're going to, you're going to, on the left here, you're going to see under login form where you can type your username and password if you already have an account. But if you don't have an account, you're going to have to type in a passphrase here in this box. New user registration. It says in order to register on this site, you must first submit the passphrase below which means below right here in this box is where you'll click and type the passphrase well we're not going to just give you the passphrase because that wouldn't do any good if we we're going to you know why have 
this system if we're just going to tell you what the passphrase is so you can create an account. So what that means is you have to do a little bit of reading. You have to help yourself, in other words. Under the main menu here, you'll see a link that says how to register. So click on that link and read this page. It doesn't take very long, but you need to read this page and understand what's required in order to register on Meekspace.com. And I'm going to kind of give you a short version of what you need to do, but uh, please read it and follow the directions, and then you'll you'll have an easier time. So really, what you're going to need to be to to create an account on Meekspace is you're going to need your Watchtower Library CD, and you're going to need your OD book. It doesn't matter what language these pieces of literature are in, you just need the Watchtower Library in whatever language and the OD book in whatever language. When you have those two pieces of literature, you need to follow these steps right here, one through five. So once you've you've looked up, you've you've read the question, you've used the literature to look up the answer, you might want to jot down your answers on a piece of paper. Your answers are going to be four answers, and they're all going to be numbers. They're going to look like here in number five. Here is an example of what you might type in. The, the answers are going to be four different answers, all numbers, and you'll type them all together with spaces. And where are you going to type them? You're going to type them on the left over here under New User Registration. In order to register on this site, you must first submit the passphrase below. So you'll click in this box and you'll type your passphrase that you assembled yourself using your Watchtower Library and your OD book. So once you've gotten that together, click here, type it in, hit submit. The next thing that's going to happen is you're going to get a page that lets you register for an account. So it'll ask your username, it'll ask for a name, uh, username, and ask for your email, and it'll let you create an account. Then it's going to email you a verification email. You'll check your email, click on it, and it'll activate your account. That's all there is to becoming a member of Meekspace. Once you've done that, you need to come back to the site and you need to log in. So we'll go to the home, we'll go down here to log in, and I'm going to log in with my account. And once you have your account and you log in, you're going to notice when you first get logged in that you have a lot of extra links over here under main menu. Well, the one that you're concerned about is how to get files on your device. After all, that's what you're here for. You want to get theocratic files on whatever device you have. So click on how to get files on your device. The first thing you want to do right off the bat, after you've created an account, you've logged in, you have went to how to get files on your device, you want to click on this link that says click this link to become a collaborator. It doesn't matter if you have an iPhone, an iPad, an iPod Touch, an Android device, a Blackberry, a Palm OS, or a tablet of whatever sort, whether it's running WebOS, Android, Apple's OS, doesn't matter. The first thing you want to do once you get an account and you get logged in at Meekspace is you want to click this link that says click this link to become a collaborator. So click it. You should get a box. It should take you to box.net, and you should get a sign-up page. But this sign-up page is different than the one you're going to get if you just were to go to box.net and click up to sign up. This one is an invitation link that is going to invite you to to collaborate with the theocratic folder that we have shared. So you should see this here. It should say share files in the theocratic folder and this folder. Please see the files I've shared with you by creating a free account. So over here on the right you're going to want to put in your email, put a username, put a password, and you want to continue. That's going to create an account. Now if you've already created an account because you did it before following these directions, you still want to click on that link, become a collaborator, make sure that you're not logged in to box.net. So if you are, go and log out of box.net. Come to that link, click on it, 
Down here, you notice, already have an account? Log in to access files from your account. So you can click here. You can become a collaborator using the account you've already created. So once you've done that, then you want to log into your Box.net account. I'm going to just go to Box.net because I already have an account. And I'm going to log in. When you get logged in, you're going to have one folder. You're not going to have all these folders I have. These are all my personal folders. But you're going to have one folder called Theocratic. So click on that. And you're going to have all of the folders and files and things that we are sharing. You're going to have full access to download anything here. And so what you're mainly going to want to do is access box.net with your computer, just like we just did. And you're going to want to find the files you want. And you're going to want to download them to your computer. Once you've got them on your computer, then you need to get them on your device. And you'll have to find the video or the tutorial that shows you how to copy files from your computer to your device and what whatever device you have you'll have to use you know it's device specific so you'll look that video up in order to get to that point but right now you've accomplished if you followed my directions you've accomplished creating an account on MeekSpace and you've accomplished becoming a collaborator on box.net and now you have access to the theocratic files that uh, all of the brothers are providing for you from around the world. That's the point we want you to be at before you go and watch the tutorial that's specific for your device. So thanks for taking the time to watch, watch this tutorial. I hope it helps you.